Hello and welcome to Space Shark Teaches. I'm Sean from Space Shark Studios and I'm here to teach you visual scripting in Godot 3.1. Let's get started. So I've gotten a request to learn how to spawn objects using visual scripting. Um, in order to do this, you need to create first two scenes. One is just called spawner. It doesn't need anything in it. This is what you're connecting the code to. And then spawn E, which is whatever you want to spawn. You can call this ball or obstacle or bullet or whatever you want. But it all you need to know is that spawn E is what gets spawned by the code. Once you've had, had these, add it to the main scene. And let's go into the code. So I have this set up right now to basically go through and spawn a certain number of objects right now set to 10. So the ready function resets the amount spawned every time it's run. Ready only runs once, remember. And then as long as the amount that is spawned is lower than the amount to spawn, do all this. So what this does is it increases the amount spawned by one, and then it waits a second. So all this does right now is nothing um, because we're not spawning anything. So in order to spawn something, we want to disconnect this and we want to find preload over here in available nodes. Preload is where you go and drag in your spawnee. Once you have preload, you can go and drag out from the object, type in instance, and you will create a new function called packed scene instance. What this does is it's, it creates an instance of this preloaded object, this scene, within the current scene that we're in. That's not everything there is though, because if you run it, you'll see still nothing happens. That's because we need to add this new instance to spawner. So to do that, you drag spawner in, you do a drop down to self and then find add child. From this, you pass in this new instance that you created. And then we wait. And there you go. So the only limitation to this is right here. Um, I've not been able to find a way to actually use a variable to load this up. So I've tried a couple different ways. None of them seem to work. Um, thing to spawn. Sadly, I think that's just a limitation of um, a limitation of That's probably why. Um, it's a limitation of Godot. I don't know why, but it just kind of is. There's nothing that we can really do to fix this. So you can see we're kind of stuck with this is just what we have. Um, so you can load it in here, but you can't go and say, hey, I want to drag this in here after loading something because it just doesn't work. Um, so you're going to have to make a new spawner every time you want to make 
a new thing to spawn from what I gather. Um, some guides online will show you how to do this in GD script as well. It's a little bit more straightforward. Um, but as for now, this is about the best you can really do unless I find a better way to be able to set this as a variable later on. But for now, just go ahead and assume that you can spawn things, but you're stuck with using preload and preload you're stuck with setting the instance there. And that is it. Thank you for watching Space Shark Teaches. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe to the channel and remember to click the bell to always stay up to date. Please also join us on our Discord, linked in the comments, and check out our other videos if you ever want to see what else we've been up to. Thanks again for watching, and we can't wait to see what you make.